you'll also want to know something about what's called the configuration file. The configuration file, as it says, describes available processing power in terms of processing nodes. And the number of nodes you define in the configuration file determines how many instances of a process will be produced when you compile a parallel job. So this configuration file, you can go ahead and read it, pause the video here and read a bit more about it, but the file itself is called an APT file. And in fact, you'll see this, uh, here, let's go in here, you'll see this mentioned over and over again. And, and uh, earlier when we talked about orchestrate, um, you can see it in this uh, page here about execution flow. So when you execute a job, the generated OSH and OSH, we sort of talked about before, but it's an orchestrate shell script. You're not really going to be doing much with this probably, especially as you begin, but the OHS, OSH script is essentially those jobs that are compiled into parallel job flows, and they are <coughs> essentially reusable components that ex execute on the parallel information server engine allows you to use a familiar graphical point and click technique to develop job flows for extracting, cleansing, transforming, integrating, and loading data into target files, target systems, and packaged integrations. Essentially what we've been talking about, th these jobs that you're creating will get compiled into orchestrate, OSH, and the OSH scripts are all controlled through this file called apt config file. And those are used to create a score, and you can read about this uh, here. The file itself looks like this and it defines the nodes that we've been talking about. So it'll give you the name of the node, uh, the pools if there are any, things that, especially as you're beginning, you're really not going to use much, but essentially this, this file is what determines parallelism, uh, how, how much parallelism is involved, how many nodes, how many processes, uh, processors uh, are handling your jobs. And so that's important because uh, if you want more speed out of a slow running job, this is essentially the place to um, to place to look. Here's a bit more information. It has the master control file. Uh, the best feature in DS is config file understands the architecture of the system. So it uh, again, it describes the degree of parallelism.